All right, hello everyone. So, first tribal council of a new season. Uh, Exaki, how do you think the challenge in terms of trying to get everyone uh, to come to a uh, the best best strategy in order to win, and why do you think it didn't work? Um, I mean, I couldn't really see much of what was going on in the challenge besides my portion. I was kind of just focused on hitting my opponent off and getting snowballs. But from what I saw, the earlier parts went pretty well. Like, I, towards the end, it seemed like we struggled a bit. Zach Eagle definitely uh, carried their team in that part. Um, but yeah, I, I think we honestly did the best we could have done. So, uh, Garrett, as a newcomer to this uh, Survivor UHC, how do you think the dynamics of camp have been uh, since you've been mingling with uh, former players of Survivor UHC? I mean, the way that I play this game is, you know, everyone's their own individual player. I'm not going to, you know, look at past seasons to, you know, determine, you know, because if they play the same way they did in past seasons, obviously for most of these individuals, they didn't win. So why would they keep the same strategy if it didn't work out before? So, you know, it's a fresh pitch for everyone. It's a new, you know, new chapter. So, you know, they might have been the favorites, but I, I treat them, you know, everyone's equal. You know, Martin Luther King once said, I have a dream where we'll be judged based on our content of our character and not our skin. And, you know, I sort of, you know, think of it like the same way. We're going to be judged off of what we're doing now, not what we did, in the, you know, in the past. Amen. Uh, uh, yeah. So, so you know that statement. You know, it seemed to be you know pretty heartwarming. Uh, but do you think that it's like entirely true? Do you think that there is a complete like equalization at camp in terms of uh, what everyone's start level is or what people's roles are in the game right now? Garrett. Aaron. Oh, me. Book. I yeah. thought it was for Garrett. My bad. Yeah. Um. I'd say there's obviously uh, probably a little variance in just how people start off because no no one it's never ever gonna be in, in playing field no matter how you play a game or what. But I do believe that there's not a huge variance. I uh, I I'd honestly say that anyone could go. Uh, so Chalk and King, you know, in Season 2, you guys both went to the first Tribal Council. Do you guys have that same, like, jitters from going to the- actually, Americ 2 in Season 3. You guys got the same- I haven't seen that yet. <laughs> wow, spoilers. Wow. So you all three went to the first Tribal Council. How do you think that those, like, first Tribal Council jitters, are they coming back to you guys? 100%, because you don't know what's gonna go on. Uh, what about you, Emeric? Uh, I definitely feel it more so in this one, but that's just the nature of there being 12 people in this tribe as opposed to the amount that was in the last one. So it's a bit more hard to predict this time. Based on what Emeric said, uh, Sugar, do you think that the size of the tribe has definitely di affected the dynamic of uh, the camp and the scramble? Yeah, um, it's when I first played, there was eight other people up that I really work out and sort of uh, deal with it in a way, and I struggled with that at first, so now I'm going to do it with 11 people, and apart from, well, DYM from Season 1, the, I haven't really played with this group of people before, um, so it's sort of like, you know, how, how do you manage 11 relationships and try and, con try and convince other people to vote out one of those relationships that you're trying to make at the same time? <laughs> Glenn, uh, back at camp, you suffered a death. Uh, are you sure hoping did. that this doesn't affect you uh, or your tribe in the next challenge, knowing that there's a penalty? Well, that creeper came out of nowhere. Like, I, I hope not. It would be a it would be a bad way to go. That's for sure. Yeah, but so did Zach. Yeah, Zach died. Zach died as well. Rocky. Like, so, at, uh, do you think that the tribe, how do you think the tribe dynamics came down to at camp? Like, how were people separating off and making uh, possible decisions, in a way, what? for the vote tonight? For, like, how did, how did the scramble generally go? Like, how did people uh, resolve it? <laughs> we split off. 
<laughs> Full stop. Good talk, Rockstar. But, Puppet, could you elaborate, maybe? Yeah, basically we split up into like, uh, six. Like, they have, have the trap with other people and others. Then, but it was with other people. We talked with more people. It was fun. Yeah. Donuts. I like this dude. Hey. Alright. I'm sorry if I can't get everyone a question, it's because I want to speed it up. Alright, with that it is time to vote. Two people will be voting uh, at the same time. Pepit, Americ, you're up. That's, that's oh. a game So either changing. go this way. Miles. Oh. Which oh, way do we go? Ahead. Go this way. Are you yeah. supposed to go one one like like both of us? Of us? No, Americ, that way. Oh, oh there's two different plus systems. Dude, if oh. Sugar. You would be with him I couldn't figure yeah. out where to put it, but I figured it out. Okay. Why am I scared for this? I really hope it's not me getting blindsided today, but... What did I put in the chest? Chest? I got Dope. If anyone has a hidden immunity idol and you would like to play it, now would be the time to do so. Alright, once the vote's read, the decision is final. person voted out will be asked to leave the tribal council immediately. And they'll bring me their torch, and I'll stuff it right there. I'll read the vote. First vote. Americ. Rocky. Americ. Americ. That's three votes Americ, one vote Rocky. Well, this is pretty yikes. Americ. Americ. That's five votes Americ, one vote Rocky. Americ. That's six votes Americ, one vote Rocky. I thought we were voting King. First person voted out of Survivor UHC. Fans versus favorites, Americ. <sighs> Did you bring me your torch? Sorry, Americ. Do it, Love you. Sorry, brother. Okay. Honestly, I don't blame you. That was a pretty terrible time. So. Americ, the tribe is spoken. Hey. Time for you to go. Back there. That way. Well, despite a slightly divided tribe, you wound up with a unanimous vote. So. We'll see how the game plays out after that. Okay. Grab your stuff, I'll see you guys at the challenge. Thanks for that. All I can say is that at the very least it was seemingly I was the only person to vote for Rocky, so at the very least the tribe is still unified, so that's got it going for them, but honestly that was just horrific because there were too many people, no one seemed to want to say any names. I was, um, the only person I was with the only people I was with was uh, Garrett and Sugar. They were the only people who mentioned any names. I tried to spread Rocky, but I don't know if that just backfired, but hey, it is what it is.